Hello everyone and welcome to my Adobe After Effects tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how did I create this uh, visual effect or this video effect inside Adobe After Effects. So this kind of video effect can uh, be used at a lot of places. Okay, say you are creating a flashback scene or you are creating an intro for a video or a transition or anything like that. Uh, this effect can be used in those situations. Okay, so let's take a look. So I can see we have that little focus out of focus blur effect and that looks very very nice. This is a very basic effect. Okay, this is for real beginners and you know it's just it's, I think it's a good idea. So you know if you haven't tried out this effect then I would um, advise you all to go ahead and try it out. Okay, so uh, get your video inside your After Effects and uh, actually I'm just going to delete this uh, video right now. I'm going to import my video once again and now I have this. I'm going to go over here to my FX and presets. I'm going to type in CC uh, RA and I think it should come up. The CC Radial Fast Blur. And this time now there, there are actually two versions. The Radial Blur and this effect you know works with this version but I would really really want to work with the Radial Fast Blur. I'm going to take that and drop it onto my video and there we have it. Now uh, the center can be changed of course from here to here. You can really see that we can create different effects uh, just by animating the center alone. So you know basically there are lots and lots of um, you know uh, what do you say uh, possibilities of creating different visual effects only by using this you know effect alone. So anyways uh, let's continue with my tutorial. I'm going to start anim the animation for the amount. I'm going to hit the U key for revealing all the keyframes. And I'm, I'm going to change the very first keyframe to and easy ease. So basically what's going to happen is every other keyframe I create is already going to be an easy ease keyframe. And that just saves me a little time. I'm going to shift page down that jumps 10 frames for me. And I'm going to take this amount all the way up to 100. So you can see right now. And right now the first keyframe should be at a full zero. So it goes at a full 100, you know, in, at a, uh, in a very small time and then it slowly comes down. So I'm going to jump 20 uh, frames ahead and I'm going to do a reset. Now if I do a reset you can see it doesn't take me to zero it keeps my value at a 50 percent. So it gives this um, so, so you know it gives my video like this blur effect and it kind of is good you know for flashback scenes and all of those kind of shots but you can kind of take it to zero and that would also look very very nice. So let's take a look at what do we have here. I'm just going to reduce it down to a quarter so you can see it uh, renders fast and there you have it. A very good transition intro effect uh, for uh, Adobe After Effects. You can use this if you are making a montage you know an AMV etc etc. So um, you know this is a very good effect definitely uh, practice with it okay come up with different possibilities of creating different visual effects. Thank you for watching this video. I will see you all in my next tutorial. Please subscribe to my channel Tutorials for Graphics and peace out friends. Take care.